Hey everybody, uh, here I am interviewing uh, Kim Land from Aurora Light Sculptures. Kim, how are you? Good, thank you. Good, thanks so much for hopping on. I greatly appreciate this. Um, probably about an hour ago through my lunch, I started looking at your website. Oh my God, like this is pretty cool stuff you do. Um, you. Every one of these things is unique. So talk to me a little bit about what is Aurora Light Sculptures? They are one of a kind creations. I can't even duplicate them. I've had people go to my website uh, and look at a sold piece and say, can you do this one again? I can't. You know, two pieces of driftwood are alike. Right. They're usually on a base of driftwood. And, and then I apply, um, I insert the electrical and then um, work with Reed and on the Certain ones, I, I put 10 layers of tissue paper, each individually applied. There's a glue mixture, a special glue that I pH balance myself. And the tissue paper that I use is pH neutral, so it will last generations. It's very durable. I can, people look at it and go, oh, tissue paper, it's going to be so fragile. No, I can pish note it and it's, it's fine. I have a demo model that I bring to events with me so that I can show people how durable it is. You can wipe it down if the kids get popsicle fingers on it. Okay. So it's, um, it is quite durable, but I try to keep everything as organic as possible. My, I don't treat the driftwood. I want to keep it as natural as I can. I am inspired by nature, so it's, uh, I want to keep things natural. Wow, some of these are absolutely stunning, like the rolling hills. Thank um, you. Wow, like just, people, you have to, you have to go to Aurora, Aurora Lights Sculptures, no, auroralightsculptures.com. I'll put a link down below. <laughs> um, you got to check this stuff out. This is, this is very unique. How do you get the colors in it? Is that just um, paint? What? No, uh, if it's the tissue paper kind, it's a, it's a colored tissue paper. And if it's the rice paper kind, which is the more uh, rectangular kind, um, that's a specialty paper on top. So the colors would be um, integrated into the paper. I am, I have things rolling around in my head. I will be starting to paint some soon. Uh, especially cool. now that we have all this free time on our hands. <laughs> But um, I how do have you, some how did you how, how did you start doing this? Where did this come from? One picture on the internet. And really? I just took off with it because it, it took me about a, close to a year before I could show people what I was doing. Um, it was a lot of learning. And um, it was a huge learning curve uh, for me. And, but it was, um, it was trial and error. Yeah, and, and how long has this been a passion of yours now for? I started this in 2017, so really? not that long ago. So yep. all these pieces that are on your site, and there's dozens of them, are those all your creations? Yes. Wow, that's outstanding. Now, are these in stock, ready to go? People can buy them? On the, on the website itself, on the first section, if they, they're, um, they look normal, then those are available. As you get to page three, they're right. grayed out. Yeah. Those are sold. I understand. Okay. That's why I was, I was going to ask you that next. Why are some of the images grayed out? You can still see them, but they're yes. grayed out. So it shows you. Um, yeah. I, I still want people to be inspired by it. Say, okay, Kim, because uh, I do a lot of custom work. I want them to say, okay, Kim, do you see rolling hills? Can you, can you do something similar to that, but a little bit bigger or a little bit smaller? So I, I work with people in that respect. Very interesting. And all of the, um, the wood that you're using, where, where is all that coming from? Just from your travels? Various fishing trips. We do a lot of fishing up here. That's awesome. Um, and so I have to, I make him stop. He complains the whole time, but <laughs> you know, I'll, I'll come back and we'll fill half the boat with driftwood sometimes. So he'll only complain until the revenue start pouring in. Then he'll, <laughs> then he, then he'll be quiet. <laughs> and then he says, let's go get some more. <laughs> right. Yeah. You know what? I, we can't do this justice um, in this zoom meeting. People have to go to the website to actually check this stuff out. 
Um, so COVID, I suspect, are you closed as well? Yeah. Um, I start booking events a year in advance. In advance. Um, pretty much all of them are canceled. If, if they're not canceled, then they're postponed. I, by now, I would have heard about my fall shows, whether I'm accepted or not, and they're just not getting back to people. They don't know. Yeah, and they don't sure. want to take our money because it's, it's, they don't know if it, they're going to have to return it or not. Yeah. So yeah. it's dicey. So I've been focusing on online uh, Facebook promotions, um, various uh, virtual, virtual events. I've been focusing Not on that virtual. and I've been pushing the classes as well um, online uh, through, through my Facebook page. Talk to me about the classes. You offer classes? The classes are for the rice paper ones. Okay. Um, the class will last about three hours. It depends how much. If you're not very crafty and you have a couple glasses of wine, sometimes it might last maybe five hours. Right. Okay. Um, I send everything to the person via mail and then we go on Facebook and we do the class that way. And I make them one with them as at the same time. Wow. That's so cool. It's amazing what is being accomplished virtually, you know, um, that that's incredible. Um, okay. So can they buy right from your website? How, what does that look like? Yeah. Um, they can uh, buy directly from the website or I think he set up cart. God, I, I didn't set up my website. So uh, okay. to be honest with you, I'm not sure. I, I don't see a cart. So I think okay. probably they, they should reach out to you. I'll put your contact information down um, and then they can select the piece yeah. and you can make arrangements for. I do piece. square. Um, so I can do square over the phone if they're not comfortable emailing me the, um, the credit card inform information. Okay. I do e-transfers. We can do it that way as well. Okay. And um, so I, I, I noticed you have a lot of them in stock. Would they, is that, um, you do you deliver as well? What, what does that look like during COVID? Um, right now, yes, I can deliver. Um, but uh, chances are I would ship it instead. Like say if it's North Bay or something, we'd make arrangements. Okay. Um, I do ship though. It, it's usually Canada Post. I only have Canada Post and Perlator available to me here. It's very unique stuff. I, I didn't know that you uh, were around this area putting out this type of product. Very, very cool. Very unique. So different. You're like you said. There's only sixty of probably in Canada doing this. Yeah. So you're not going to see a, a, a second piece, right? No. You can't duplicate them. You're never going to find the, you can't um, predict how the paper is going to shrink around the reed. So they might have different bumps or curves to them. Um, and it can't be duplicated. And even the, you're never going to find two pieces of driftwood alike. Yeah. I love the driftwood. It just, it, it looks so beautiful when you wrap it or you do whatever you do. Thank you. Look, the, the, it really looks very cool. So hats off, man. That's, that's awesome. And it's only been since 2017. So like three years, maybe. Yep. I just wow. finished. Um, I had my second show season. Um, show season uh, would end in December. And um, yeah, it was, uh, it's been a big learning curve. It's exciting, eh? Yeah. Exciting. Uh, I was just talking to, um, uh, Jen, uh, Jen Nickerson, manager at the, uh, the business center, Nipissing Perry Sound. And uh, they have all kinds of entrepreneurs, startups, and even people expanding their businesses. Kind of come see them as the first stop because they can really, you know, put you down a lane to funding, show you where, some, where you can get some funding and different resources and stuff. And, um, you know, this is, this is very interesting because that kind of fits along with that too. So, perhaps where you're located, you know, you've got chambers of commerce and all those places that, you know, might be able to help you, you know, do this. But right now it's all about Facebook and Instagram. Get these images out there. Very powerful, very good looking stuff. Um, did you have anything else you wanted to add? Did I miss anything? I think we're good. Okay. So I'll put links in for Aurora light We'll put your phone number in there as well. 
And um, thank you so much for uh, coming on, Kim. I greatly appreciate it. You're doing some pretty cool things. And it's, thank you, it's good to see. Thank you. All right. We'll talk again real soon. Thank you. Sounds good. Okay. Bye-bye. Bye. -bye. Bye.